Hey guys, how's it going? It's Matt from Fidelity Gaming TV and welcome to opening day here in year 2018 with the Braves. Mac Money is back without a beard. Well, I guess he has one. It's a little stubble. But uh, he is back and ready to win. Man, it feels good to see Mac Money back in action here as the offseason has completed and it's time for some baseball here in April. Braves and Yankees here at Turner Field getting set for the first pitch of the season. As the waiting is over, Mac was very patient last year with the Braves, who were just awful when they should have done better. And um, I guess they kind of cleaned up their act, but it was too little too late. They finished above 500 by just a couple of games. And um, no room for excuses this year. The Braves have to win. They had an okay offseason, a little bit of a different look, as they added, uh, I guess the main person that they added that is the highlight of their offseason was Matt Cain. And uh, hopefully he can bring them what they need, which is a solid number two starter. Defense and pitching is what they need this year. They upgraded a little bit on pitching. Obviously, Teheran, our number one guy. Then Matt Kane, Dylan Gee, Josh Trotar, and a couple of others, including Alex Wood, who only had seven wins last year. So that is that. Matt coming up to the plate here. First at bat of the year, he went, uh, he hit 304 last year with 23 homers. And I think that's at 89 RBIs, so he is looking to improve on that. And this is not a good start, as he fouls that one to the right of first base, but that's going to be playable. And that is it. He's retired on the first at-bat of the season. That's all right. He'll come back in here as the Yanks are still up 2-1 to one here in the bottom of the fourth. No one on base, one out as Max steps up to the plate. 1-1 pitch coming, and he's hitting this one right up the middle past the diving shortstop. And he'll make it on first for his first base hit of the season. So nice to see that. 15 points for that base hit. As he is looking to reform into that uh, second, his first full season in the MLB was an almost M, uh, an MVP caliber, caliber season. He finished runner-up to Miguel Cabrera. And that was way back in 2016. Um, and then last year he got traded, did okay. And now he's hitting a triple. Nice job there by Mac is that one's a gapper and that's easily gonna be a triple it's just a matter of if the runner comes home and scores and he does he is safe and that's an rbi triple actually a two rbi triple so 28 points for that at bat as you see that is julian russell who is a 99 overall second baseman for the braves he dropped to an 81 overall a full 18 overalls that is insane as now we tie the game up at four and that's another base hit for mac money so that's his third hit on the day, looking pretty good. Like I said, trying to regain that MLB, or MLB, I keep wanting to say MLB, the MVP um, style of play that he had a couple of years ago. Braves with the mini comeback. They win this one 6-4, Ed Beltre with the win. Craig Kimbrell with the save. That's what we want to see. Um, I guess the problem wasn't really scoring last year. It was sometimes, but not really. We had a lot of power, but it was mainly stopping the other team from scoring so as long as we can shape up our defense then we're going to be in good shape as we are still at home this time taking on the Mets and Mac is up to the plate and that's a fair ball down the left field line as the runner on first is going to advance around third no he's going to stay at third but Mac has himself a double so a nice job there as he'll get 18 points for the at bat and he is looking good so far this year and so are the Braves who are now up five to two it's good to see as Mac comes up to the plate one for two so far on the night no one on, one out, and 1-0 pitch is coming to Max. 64th of the night, and that is hit in the gap. No, oh, it's not gone, but it is going to fall to the wall, and it is going to be about a double and a half for Mac Money. So get the double, 15 points, and he is yet again on second base. So still 5-2 to two here in the sixth inning, I believe. Mac in the field trotting to his left, and he's going to make that catch 10 out of 10 times trying to throw out the runner going to third tagging up but uh, I, the arm strength is there maybe the arm act isn't there but uh, it was just kind of a hard play to make anyways that's all right 5-3 now in the top of the ninth Mac can end the game with a catch and he does just that eight points for the fielding opportunity and mo more importantly the Braves win so so far they're looking pretty good 5-3 is the final score Mac money the top hitter for the Braves going two for four with a run scored which is nice to see, and he's in fact your player of the game as he had two doubles, a single, or actually no, two doubles, 
and that is it and a run scored so a very productive game for him he has his first player of the game of this young 2018 season as like I said I want to say it again just trying to regain that MVP type uh, play for this season so we're simming through here and we already are making a trade with the Dodgers getting the starting pitcher Ryu and we had to give up a uh, pretty important piece I guess you could say uh, center fielder John Jay I guess not that important but um, you know he added some depth and that was good to have but we don't have that anymore we're just trying to get starting pitching Ryu is a 79 overall so we'll see what we can do with him here as we make our way to Philadelphia the city of brotherly love I think is what they call it or brothers or something anyways enough of that Mac has got some work to do and he is doing just that getting a single up the middle for a base hit so he is starting off very hot here in this 2018 season as we'll get 14 points for the at bat and it is already three nothing Braves here in the bottom of the first he's in the field trying to make this catch routine 10 out of 10 times he will make it and he does so nice work there by Mac as we'll get 18 or eight points for that fielding opportunity as we see Matt Kane for the first time this season but Philly has also put up a three spot Braves answer with two more, 5-3 now. Runners on the corners with one out in the top of the seventh. And that is going to be a nice play from third base. Mac cannot believe that. He'll get the RBI in five points, but he thought that was either a base hit or just mad at himself for not running hard enough. But uh, the Braves are putting on some more runs here. 8-3 to three now in the top of the ninth. Mac up to bat. No outs. Runner on first, and that is a base hit up the right side. But check this out. A shallow one at that, and yeah, the runner had to hold up going to second, and they're going to call that not even a base hit. Are you kidding me? So this is what happens. Mac somehow doesn't get the single, but he singles into right. Runner from first advances. I think that was Julian Russell to uh, from first to second. He gets tagged out, and as a result, they're not going to call that a single. I think that should be a single, but uh, this game thinks otherwise. Braves win 11-7. Mack went 1 for 5. Should have went 2 for 5 with 2 runs and an RBI. Here's the thing, though. We scored 11 runs, but we gave up 7. So we got lucky in that one. But if you know, you're know giving up 7 runs, that's not good. You may not win a lot of those games. So we will travel to City Field, the other side of New York, against the Mets again, as the Braves are looking pretty good so far. I mean, it's early in the season, but it's always good to get a start. As they say, you can't win a World Series in April, but you can certainly lose it. So we don't want to dig ourselves in a big hole early on, and we're not doing that. So Mac, uh, yeah, continues his hot start. He's doing awesome right now. 12 points for that at bat as he gets the single up the middle. Next at bat, one nothing Mets. Top the third. He is hitting this one high and deep to right. Is this the first homer? Nah, just in front of the warning track there. So, guys... Uh, Still looking for the power, but you know what? If he's not hitting home runs, at least he's keeping his average up, and he's doing just that with some singles and doubles, even one triple as he's in the field now. Making this catch doesn't even really have to move. Maybe a step forward or two, but uh, piece of cake there for Mac. Eight points for that fielding opportunity as we will move forward. To the end of the game, we don't score any runs. We only give up one. This is this just sucks. Ryu with his first, or actually, uh, I guess this is probably his first start with the Braves. Only allows one run, and we lose one nothing. That just sucks right there. Braves are 8-5. Unfortunately, they're second place because of these guys. Washington Nationals, who are 10-3 with the right fielder that is always competing with Mac Money for the All-Star spot. Bryce Harper, he is tearing it up. So are the whole Nationals team. And uh, you can see Mac in the last four games hitting 500. That's good. Bottom of the first. No one on, two outs. And this is hit over to Rendon at second. Or at short, I should say. And... Yeah, that's it. He gets retired there as he will come back up to the plate. Washington up 1-0 in the bottom of the fourth. Mac up to the plate. No one on, no one out. 0-1 pitch to Mac, and he's hitting this one right in front of Doug Fister, who will pick it up, turn around, and fire to first for the out. So Mac is once again retired. These Nationals are a good team. You know, you can't expect to do well against them, and they are shutting Mac down. Still up by 1, 3-2 now as Mac is in the field. Trying to make this catch, and he does, I think. Yeah, he does, and we'll get six points for the opportunity. Uh, I guess plus there is being Atlanta score, but we can't score any more runs. We lose this one 3-2 to two. as Mac goes 0-4. for 4. The Nats stopped him pretty well there as Rex Brothers gets the win for the Nationals. So that's going to do it for today's episode of Mac Money Road to the Show. I hope you guys enjoyed. 
it is good to see Mac back in action here in the 2018 season. As you see our upcoming schedule to finish out April, the first month of the season. He hasn't got a home run yet. Well, I guess he has, but you haven't seen one yet. And hopefully he can get one in the next episode. So, again, if you haven't seen the ALDS with the Yankees and Rusty Rogers, go ahead and check the annotation out next. Subscribe and peace.